Good afternoon, viewers. Welcome to Sunday, the 3rd of December. Barry Fear with you on the program this afternoon and joining me in the studio. It's good afternoon to my offsider. Good afternoon, Barry. Good afternoon, viewers. Nice day today. Beginning of summer. Yep. We're looking forward to a lot of fun in the sun this year. Okay, well, 2017, everybody, has nearly gone out the door and with, and with a couple of weeks left till the big man himself in red arrives, that is Santa Claus, you better get your Christmas shopping in pretty quickly or done pretty quickly, I should say. And here's my offside end now. Yes, ho, 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 Barry. Some people are going shopping next week on Saturday, some people on Sunday. So get your orders in. And also we've got some highlights to share with you now. And the big one in February, we brought to you the James Taylor concert. Here's my offside for that bit of news. Yep, the concert was terrific in February. Do you want to go see um, Carol King? When is that? Well, it's a Carol King musical on the next month. And we'll think about it. We'll think about it. So James Taylor was really good. He he sang all his songs. And we had a big, big good night there. And a lot of things happened this year. We had some staff changes again as usual. Um, and um, the big highlight for me was um, going down to Victoria to farewell my grandmother who passed away in July, and also getting this marvellous computer which I'm bringing the show to you on now. And the beehives. Let's take you outside now to have a look at it. Okay, well the bees are buzzing around uh, outside in this the hive here and um, here's my offsider to tell you about the beehive. Yes, they're Australian native honey bees, Barry. We might just turn the camera around and show the viewers. And they've been doing a very good job collecting their honey. And I think that's going to be harvested in another few weeks. And, uh, and this is outside my studio, the studio here. Um, and it's the second weekend of the beehive. And if you're in the honey, everybody, well, you won't have to go to the store for, for honey anymore after this. So here's my offside and to tell you what's coming up over the next month here. We'll have Barry the Bee Honey. Sweet, tasty. And um, the most important thing is Eating healthy. Now we all know how important it is to eat healthy during the summer months. Now, here's my upside to tell you this. Yep, we're going to have a healthy eating summer. 
this year. And they heard knocking on the window here. Uh, one of the one of the staff is wants to get on camera. I think. I We're gonna have a healthy eating New Year this year, over Christmas New Year, Barry. Bring some healthy recipes, healthy ideas, how to keep fit, not get sick, intestinal health. And the, another thing we'd like to bring up is safety wherever you are going. So, what I'm holding up for you viewers is a mobile phone. And when should you be using it? Whenever you go out, Anyway, don't just go out without telling anybody. Give my offside for this. Yes, good advice, Barry. Always tell a staff member if you're going out and take your phone. Otherwise, leave a contact number where you're going to and try and advise the time you'll be coming home. And don't and don't go into places where you you are likely to get get stuck either. Where and the fire brigade has to pull you out like another resident did. Like soft boggy ground in parks. And here's my offside for this. Yeah. And try and avoid going along the road. If you can help it, stick to the footpath. And yeah. always use pedestrian crossings to cross the road. And, and, and a thing that disgusted me this morning was a, a motorcycle, well, a, a man on his, on his bike riding on the harbour bridge instead of on the footpath. Is my upside of the bit. Yep, very dangerous activity, Barry. They can not only hurt or kill themselves, they could hurt or kill someone else. So please, viewers, don't be an idiot out in the community. And another thing we always bring up is triple zero. Save that for emergencies. Here's my upside. Yep, that's what the triple zero number's for, Barry. It's not just in case you stub your toe or you might have indigestion. It's only if you've got a true emergency. Possibly heart attack, broken leg. Or chest pain, so please don't be an idiot out there. We don't want you being an idiot. And tonight for dinner, what have we got? We've got butterfly chicken and roast vegetables. On a wrap for me tonight. Mm -mm. And what's a butterfly chicken, the viewers want to know? Uh, it's a certain cut of chicken. It's a butterfly, using mostly breast and thighs. Well, it's now time for a break on the show, but um, let's take him back inside the studio now and we'll take a break. Well, as I've been saying to you, Bill, to you viewers, 2017 has been a bumpy year, and here's my offside to tell you about what a year it has been. Been a very eventful year, Barry. Uh, some people coming and going. Um, we've got a new client this year, um, some new staff. And we're all looking forward to the Christmas holiday break and, and a good year 2018. And the new hospital is coming up, opening up to everybody, so... When's that open, Barry? 
sometime in 2018, so... Possibly in 12 months' time? Possibly in 12 months. Mm, that would be good. So if you're ever in need of an emergency, you are at the hospital in five minutes. Well, that'd be good for an ambulance too, wouldn't it? Ambulance will get you to the hospital in five minutes. And it's time now to say good afternoon for the moment on the on the show, but we'll be back to continue the rest of the show afterwards. But um, the time now is uh, medication time, proudly brought to you by Panadol Alexa. Use only as directed. We'll be back later on in the show to talk about the all-important Christmas break. <laughs> 